some unwanted guests. The story comes from Taylorsville in Spencer County. And the mayor there says they're doing everything they can to control what's become a growing stray cat problem. Nearly 1,800 people live in the city of Taylorsville. A population that seems to be growing. Come down here. Everywhere I go. You'll see an unwanted group. Cats. 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 Go on a back seat back here. Cats. Stray cats have made this their home. I mean, I've seen stray dogs in big cities. But this little town with cats galore. They're downtown at the gas station. They're rolling around people's homes. Mickey Goodlett's neighbor, Tabitha Nation, couldn't help but chime in on the cat troubles. There's a bunch of cat freaks there. Just go up and down the bar on time, scratch it. I can't tell you this. It's ridiculous. Here's up your bars. Mayor Don Pay has heard the complaints. I saw in regards to the cat problems. One after another. I unfortunately have like 15 to extra cats that live on the my house. Pay believes the cat problem isn't isolated to their town. The issue that we have in Taylorsville and Spencer County is that our um, our Humane Society contract only deals with dogs, so it doesn't have any provisions in there for the cat overpopulation problems. For that reason, he says they'll round them up, take them to Louisville, work with alley cats advocates to get them spay and neutered, and then bring them back home. Pay, who is a cat lover himself, has a sense of humor about the whole thing. The mice population is, is down, and, and birds are nervous, and squirrels are nervous. But, uh, yeah, it's a, it's a problem, but I think it's probably the, the most effective way to deal with it. But Goodlett hopes more can be done. I mean, you got, I got you. I fed them. I mean, you got you. They're starving. And, but that's all I can do to them. I, mean, I can't take them in the house. Uh, wait till the sun goes down and towards dark and just ride around and see cats everywhere. Mayor Pay says this has been an ongoing problem for several years. He says they've spayed and neutered at least 100 cats and still have about two to 300 more to go. He believes it's those efforts that will eventually help lower the stray cat population. Well, tensions continue to rise.